welcome to Los Angeles Standard Time here on Planet IMAX. Thank you so much for honoring your time by receiving this incredible, relaxing 15 minutes in a time zone of just natural bliss and inward journey. I am here with our incredible friend, Paul Kay, and he's going to walk us through some simple intention setting, mindfulness practices, and yoga poses to get you ready for a full, fun day, Monday, for Planet IMAX. Wonderful to be with you all. And let's just start with a, a stretch. We're not gonna go into conventional yoga poses because I want you to be able to do this while you're sitting at your desk or wherever you are. And it's one of the healthiest practices I know. It's called pandiculation. I know that sounds very, um, whoa, pandiculation. It's actually a yawn. When we yawn, we pandiculate. And if you notice when we yawn, our jaw doesn't pop open like that. It yawns. The muscles pull in as we push out and that's what we're gonna be doing with our bodies. So we're just going to now step aside a little bit and we're going to open up our arms in this posture, but just keep yawning. Let's just do that again. Come in and pull the energy in as you push out. So as you push out, reach, 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 and open the joints, open the shoulder, open the elbows, the wrists, the fingertips, go, go, go. Keep yawning, yawn the body, really feel it, just like your cat does, just like your cat or your dog. Come back again. This time we're gonna add the feet. This is the critical part. We're gonna push into the ground as we push away. We can do this one side first so you get the idea. I'm gonna push into my left foot as I push away with my right hand. So I've got this cross fascial stretch. Push into your left foot and then stretch away with your right hand. Just keep going, stretch, yes. Open up, open, that's the key. Now the other side open up the left side, push into the right foot down into the ground and allow this left, oh, I can feel my back popping. That's what we want to do. We want to decompress, decompressing the spine. Beautiful. Now we're going to go across the whole body like a big X, pushing down on both feet and pushing out, but going across the body. Open, open, open. Now the key again is it doesn't work if you just go like this. This doesn't do anything. And even just stretching out doesn't do anything. We want to be pulling into the body as we push away. So it's almost like you're pushing away something, right? It's almost like you're opening a door or pushing away as you open up. Good. Now we're going to add the head and the tailbone. We want the tailbone towards the ground and the head towards the sky so that we've got this nice elongation and we go up again. We stretch out, yes, this time adding the head and the tailbone. Excellent, keep going, yes. Now remember, pushing in, this way you won't hurt yourself. Now if you're sitting in a chair, you can push down into the left sit bone and the right hand, the right sit bone and the left hand. You can just get this, Sitting at your desk is perfect for this kind of action. When we push upwards, we want to have the head. A lot of us suffering from this text neck, right? We're all doing this kind of thing over our computers and our devices. We want to have the head come back on top of our head. Yes. Feel behind your palate, your soft palate. That's where your head rests on your spine, your skull. And we want to have nodding from there. Remember, pull in to push out. Pull in to push out and open the joints. Feel the joints. And now you can feel it through your whole spine. Now let's just take that back a little bit because we want to open up the chest. Let's just open up the chest. So we've got this crossed. And now we just want to open up and lift from the heart. Lift from the heart. Don't strain at all. Again, we're just opening up the body. Can you feel that at the back of your chest? And come down again. Come back, has a nice exhale. Relax a second. 
Just feel where your body is. You should start feeling a little bit more buoyant, a little decompressed. And now, just one more time, come back up. And again, that, just that little arch back a little bit, lift from the heart a little bit more. Yes, a bit further up, head a bit further back. Yes, out more. Stretching, yes, good. Ah, again, yawning. Excellent, Tui. And now just relax. And just see where that feels. How does that feel for you? It's great because you're fully present and focused on intentionally stretching as far as you can. Yeah, it's different than just going like this, right? Yeah. It's just like it's a yawning. It's like you're pushing away something and you're pushing into the ground. You're opening up through the whole fascial matrix. And that's different than just doing the muscles and the bones, but it does decompress the body and it brings us present. Now, I want everybody to put their hands on their hearts. And just be aware of your hearts right now. And just breathe in and out through your hearts. We're going to go into a little bit of a more meditative process now. You can do this at any time during the day. And this is an exercise from a somatic worker called Eric Franklin. And the heart, every time you breathe, the heart goes for a ride on your diaphragm. The heart rests on the top of the diaphragm and it's actually fixed to it and it goes for a ride naturally. So this is your heart is having a great wave-like motion with your breath. And you're going to say this, we're all going to say this together inwardly, but I'll say it out loud. A lifted heart is a healthy heart. So everybody just say that, a lifted heart is a healthy heart. And just really feel that lift in your heart, breathing in and out through the heart. A lifted heart is a healthy heart. Sometimes I say a happy heart, which would be true too. One more time, just say a happy heart. A lifted heart is a happy heart. Okay, now put your hands by your side and now just can you feel, look, look, Tui, you're just, <laughs> brings you present, right? It really, it's like suddenly you're just there. It's hard to slump. It's really, try to slump right now. It's really difficult to slump after that. So back, hands on the heart again. And just now, just, just do a breathing exercise with, as I inhale, I bring joy into my heart. Let's say that. As I inhale, I bring joy into my heart. Then just exhale, joy. As I inhale, I bring love into my heart. And exhale, love. As I inhale, I bring ease and relaxation into my day. And then, now just put your hands down and feel where you are. Notice how your head is much easier placed now without any tension, right? Tui, how's that feeling for you now? No tension, very relaxed. Right, so you bring, right? We, we didn't practice this beforehand. This is new to Tui as well. That's why this is in real time. And also that, that fascial stretch that we did, that pandiculation opens up the body. So now, just want you to focus on the rising and the falling of the breath. I don't want you to do anything else. You're not forcing the breath or anything. This is your key to your life. Of course, with breath, without it we die. But this is the key. If you can bring your attention to the rising and the falling of your breath, just that, you are now in harmony with your life force. And you're present in this moment. The breath can only be now. You can't take the breath you took a minute ago. You can't take a breath this afternoon. It's all right now. Now let's just take this further. Don't think of taking a breath. Receive a breath. Just receive the breath. My shoulders dropped when I said that. Just the idea of receiving. We receive life. We're not we're going so much, right? We're putting out. We think we're, we're living, we're doing. Here we are, just receiving, doing nothing, yet receiving. I'd like you to 
work with that during this day that you're just receiving the breath and come into this focus. One last stage with this, do nothing whatsoever, nothing, except be still and wait. And perhaps there's this moment where you feel this impulse of the breath, where you realize that you are not breathing. You are being breathed. Please consider that during this day. Now we're going to set an intention for your day. How are you feeling so far, Tui? You're good? It's very incredible to just be regardless of anything that's going on through the day. As event professionals, we put so much pressure, unnecessary pressure, so much stress. You know, we're constantly learning on how to handle COVID around the world. And so to take this moment, to receive this moment for the benefit of you and it, it affects others, right? It's like an act of kindness that you're allowing yourself to do. So very relaxed. Marvelous, marvelous. And, and if you feel yourself going like, oh, I've got something to do. So we go, oh, because this is our stress position. We just, a lifted heart is a happy heart or a healthy heart. And I breathe joy in and out of my heart or love, whatever, whatever you wish to do. All of these are proven techniques. I mentioned Eric Franklin, but also heart math as well. There's an amazing job with this breathing in and out of the heart. So this really, really works. So we just have to work it. Now we're going to set the intention for the day. And so we're in this relaxed place. We're in our hearts, right? And we're putting our heart now into our work, into what we're doing. The lifted heart, we're able to, even when we're just typing an email, we're just, our heart is in what we're doing. We're going to do this through the chakra centers. Very, very brief, but very easy. Bring your attention. You can close your eyes. Bring your attention to your crown chakra right on the top of your head. Just one question. What is your intuition telling you right now? This could be something that you need to do during the day, but you're going to do it in a relaxed way, in an effortless way. And if you're to do that, what does your intuition tell you? Now let's just drop down into the third eye, just in the center of the head, behind the forehead, over the ears. Visualize how your day is going to be. Make it beautiful. You're making this up. Make it beautiful. Maybe you just see colors, and that's fantastic. Now bring the energy down into your throat chakra and voice. Maybe it's an affirmation. Voice what's happening. I'm going to work today without strain, with ease, with relaxation or I'm going to complete this task. Whatever it is, you bring voice to it. And now the heart, the energy drops into the heart and here we bring our heart, our, our loving into our work. What we're going to do, we do it with joy. So that our heart energy amplifies. The heart has so much a fantastic energy field. Now we drop into our solar plexus. This is where we have the confidence the confidence to accomplish today, but not from a do, 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 but from a being. We're in contact with our heart, our voice, our spirit, our third eye and our crown. We have the confidence to go forward. Now we drop into our sacral area, just below the belly button. This chakra center is where we have relationships with others, where things are going smoothly. We're able to communicate and we get the support of others. We just feel that support. It's like we're not alone in what we're doing today. We are one. And now we bring the energy into the root chakra, right at the base of the spine. Muladhara, the root chakra. The color here is red oftentimes. And this is where we're grounded. We feel the ground beneath us. We feel now all of this energy that came from our intuition, from our spirit, into our third eye into our throat and then our heart, our solar plexus, our sacral area. Now we ground it into this world so that we can 
accomplished. And now our energy centers are aligned and we're ready to start our day. We can open our eyes. If you had them closed, it looks like a new world. We've really refreshed ourselves. How does that feel? You ready to start the day now? I am ready to start this fun Monday. And not, you were just talking about world. We are all together here at Planet IMAX, virtually, wherever you are. And Paul, thank you so much. Well, I haven't seen you this relaxed. You're normally like, go, 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 go. I am. This is the and most it, relaxed it, I've seen you. It's so difficult. You know, we are constantly conditioned thinking that we have to be so productive that we're sacrificing our own well-being. And my intention when you were saying that was slow down be here and you, it was right I did have moments where I wanted to check my phone and we're live right now but then I just came back and again I started over and I found my breath and so this was just wonderful marvelous well everyone just have a wonderful time a wonderful day and be well it's been our pleasure thank you so much